you're back at runwaynews.com. I'm your girl Tasha, and we are here live at Small Boutique Fashion Week of 2014 with some of our audience members. So we just want to get their opinions, but I'm going to allow them to introduce themselves first. Yes, my name is Chevelle. My name is Almira. Kemi. And mm, yes, Kemi is here. She is representing Fashion Week. So I just want to say, what? How do you guys enjoy the show tonight? I loved it. I mean, it's always good to see emerging designers, you know, starting and, you know, really getting out their, their work and showing and expressing themselves with their collections. I love it. It was great. Nice. So did any of you guys have a favorite designer or did you see an outfit that you personally loved? I love the colors. Um, I'm not familiar with the designer, but it was one collection that just had a lot of bright colors and... You know, her design aesthetics was very clean, and it was it was beautiful. Hi. Right, so, can you tell me what inspired your outfit tonight? Uh, well, I'm actually also a fashion designer out of the DMV area. All three of us are actually. Yes, and we came up from the DMV trying to represent, but I'll say at the same time getting a feel for what New York wants. So when we come back with our own things, then we'll be ready. But you guys traveled up to New York. <laughs> So do you want to talk a little each about your designs? Well, let's finish going over your outfit, honey. You didn't make it, did you? Or did you? Oh, she made it. Yes. Yeah, so we are going to talk about it. <laughs> well, my um, family background is from West Africa. So I take some, but I was born here. So I take the two elements, mix them together, and try and do modern day African wear. Yeah, so this is a cocktail dress that's inspired off of some African fabric. Okay, and your line is called? Léanger. And how, can you spell it out for Because people are going to be like... What, be like Tasha. Can you have her spell it for me? So I'm gonna ask her. Um, L e o n c h e. And that's dot com. They can come and reach you from there. And your line. Do you like to talk about it a little? Yes, mine is Gypsy by Chevelle, and it's spelled G P Z I by Chevelle. Um, but I like you know just different colors and using different um, textures of uh, fabrics and. You know, just to keep it fun and, and have a little punk rock, a little masculinity, but very sexy, chic, and cool. <laughs> oh, I like her. <laughs> and can we talk a little bit about Joyce? Um, well, I'm also West African as well. I also have family and a company in uh, Vietnam. So a lot of my stuff is like Asian infused with African and American pieces. So. Very nice, Runway News. I guess I've... Actually, all made our, you know... Today, all of Wait, I got to stand back and look at this, Runway News. Yes, I picked the perfect three audience members because they all made their own clothes here tonight. I bought mine just in case you guys didn't know. <laughs> but I thank you guys for... Thank you. <laughs> yes. But I thank you for taking the time to stop out of your schedules to t talk to runwaynews.com. And please, 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 I want to get your emails, your emails, so people can know where to look you up at first. Awesome. Awesome. Uh, you can uh, actually uh, email me at info at royalglobalmanufacturing.com. Again, it's info at royalglobalmanufacturing.com. Almira Wilson at leonje.com. So A-L-M-I-R-A -A, Wilson at leonje.com. <laughs> yes, you can email me at gypsybychevelle at yahoo.com. Hey, thank you. Runway News, we'll be right back to you.